Hi everyone, Jeff Teague in Raleigh, North Carolina, your complete Toyota buying resource. I have some changes to talk about with the 2020 RAV4 Hybrid. And although I don't have a 2020 RAV4 Hybrid here, I brought along something to tempt you with a little eye candy. We've got an XLE Hybrid and an XSE Hybrid. We're gonna talk about the changes so that you're informed when they get here. Since the 19 RAV4 was redesigned completely, exterior, interior, safety technology, there aren't gonna be all that many changes, but there are some. The biggest one, the biggest question I get on my Torque News reader site or my YouTube viewer site is about Android Auto. So Android Auto is standard across the board. I predicted that about two months ago. It's standard, baby, on every level of 2020 RAV4. You'll also get Sirius XM on every level. So the LE buyers, LE Hybrid, XLE Hybrid without Audio Plus, you're gonna get that, whether it's the traditional Toyota radio or the Toyota Audio Plus or the Toyo Toyota Premium Audio, you're, you're gonna get Sirius XM standard. Also Wi-Fi Connect safety connector standard. Now notice up top here, no moonroof standard on the XLE Hybrid or on the gasoline XLE. Last year they were standard XLE and above. So now they have added, Toyota has added a power driver's seat to all XLEs, all XLE hybrids and above. And I think their logic for thinking that was that more people would rather have a standard power driver's seat on an XLE or XLE hybrid than if they got a moonroof standard but still had manual controls, you know, pump it up. So um, that's the logic, yeah. Yeah, that was not polished. This is an XSE. You can always tell by the gloss black accents, the wheels, the over fenders, along the body, the top two-tone. It's all there. You can get this in silver, gray, blizzard pearl, or blue print. But that's not what I'm talking to you about. Again, this is just eye candy. The limited hybrid, this is gonna have standard JBL sound system on it. So it's got 11 speakers in nine locations. We'll count them someday. It's got an 800 watt amplifier. Frankly, it kicks butt. And then it's also got a subwoofer on it. So that's standard before you had to get the premium audio upgrade on the limited, but people thought it's the limited. I should be getting premium sound. So it's standard, woohoo. The option packages have shuffled around a little bit. It's a little confusing, a little annoying, but I can clear it up. The convenience package now only has two features on it. Power moonroof, power liftgate. So it's a power convenience package. Moonroof, liftgate. Now the weather package, heated seats used to be in the convenience package. So weather package has heated front seats, heated steering wheel, rain sensing wipers with de-icer function. There you go. Those are your packages on the XLE and those are the changes. Woo! Thank you so much for watching. If you own a RAV4 Hybrid right now, write down in the comment section what kind of MPG you're getting right now. You're down with MPG, yeah, you know me. I'm gonna be using that for a future Torque News story. Also, follow my column, my writing column, torquenews.com slash Toyota. You'll be updated on the in-depth, detailed news of Toyota. See you next time.